Yo, what's up, Tarnish? It's your boy, Albie, and we back with another video, bro. In today's video, we're going to be talking about the best ODM gear build that you can possibly do for raids. Now, for this, it's not going to guarantee that you can beat raids or anything, but it will help you get your 5% in raids. Because I've seen, when I live stream, I'll be seeing a lot of people, you know, not hit their 5%. And I thought, you know, to make this build, like, you know, just to help you all out. So, yes, it does require having Mythic drops, but you cannot, um, you can also get Mythic drops from, you know, you just doing regular missions. You don't have to do a raid if you're lucky. Or you can, you know, get carried. Somebody can actually take their time with you and let you get your 5%. You could always do it on hard, too. You feel me? You could always do the raid on hard. You don't have to do it on Aberrant, and then you have a chance to get it. I've seen somebody get, like, Titan Serum and get in a Mythic Perk at the same time in hard. So it's possible. You just got to be lucky. Um, And another thing that I would say... You can't solo. You can't with this build. You won't be. I don't think you can solo Aaron. You probably could do it on hard, probably severe. I have Brent, You're gonna need a Titan, respectfully. But let's get straight into the video. Make sure you leave a like, comment, subscribe, bro. Enough yapping for this video, and let's get straight into it. Like I said again, bro. We on the road to 17k subscribers. We're literally like what less than 100 subscribers away. Y'all crushed it. I'm not gonna lie to y'all. Y'all crushed it. You feel me? 18k. We on, well, might as well start saying we on the road to 18k, cause we might hit 17,000 a day. 17,000 stream, hey. Make sure y'all tune in. Enough yapping, bro. I've been yapping for too damn long, boy. Too damn long. So alright, what we running? Going for this ODM gear build. So for the ODM gear build, first and foremost, skill tree. We also making it a cooldown build because you need to be able to like semi spam your moves. We have a hundred, a hundred percent, well, one hundred two percent on cooldown, so that's good. And we also have um, lethal tempo with the Ackerman strike, and we're going tank build instead of you know health. And then for for um, prestige perks, we're running fly, uh, dashes. You know, you need the eye frame so you don't die. Then shield so you don't get one tapped. While well, you know Aaron likes to you know do his crazy roars here and there, throw a big ass punch at you. You need this. And then quick strike. You need this. So each time you kill, you gain um, more basically more damage over time. So as long as your blade is still there, after you refill. Uh, Resets after reloading. So, yeah, it's pretty nice. And then for perks, what I'm running is I'm running perfect form. It increases my ODM damage. And then maximum speed, you feel me? I can do maximum damage with uh, at 50% of my maximum speed. So, I don't even have to be that fast, bro, to do a crazy amount of damage. Um, And then crit, I have a crit. Crit, believe it or not, critical. Crit chat. When well, I mean, I say crit. Crit damage actually increases your damage too. It increases your damage. So I, I didn't even like. I was paying attention to it. I'm like, wow. All right, this really makes your damage go up. I didn't even know that. And then for mythics, which is something that we have in main game, so what we're running right here, it gives you 60% ODM damage. Blade durability increased by 20. You get um, blade hits can strike um, two more limbs. So you strike up to three limbs with this perk alone. And then Immortal, you know, you want to, you know, have a chance not to get an injury. You want extra health and damage reduction. So Immortal is actually pretty good. So, wow. I feel like I showed you everything. And this one, this one is not really that important. But if you do get it, I guess you can keep it. It makes you faster. Gas, control, and range has increased. But it's not like needed, needed. You know what I'm saying? It's something that if you want to use it, you can use it. So how much damage I'm outputting. With this, if I was over here, I would have been doing 162, which is not bad, which is not bad. It's, it's a lot of damage right here. We're going to go into, uh, we're just going to go into like a regular game, Abrinth. All right, we're going to test this out real quick for y'all. And no, I'm not going to be trying to be Levi Ackerman, bro. I'm just giving y'all a quick showcase so you, we can see what the damage is. Like, literally, I'm going to end the video as soon as I get my first Titan kill. You see what I'm saying? Like, I'm not even, like, I'm not going to go crazy with it, bro. So don't forget to leave a like, comment, subscribe, bro. Let me know what y'all think about the build. Is the build nuts? Do y'all... I was about to cuss. Do y'all mess with it? 
how y'all feel about it. I think this can help you get a percentage. That's why, because I was thinking about, I'm like, yo, bro, nobody get nobody gets a percentage for real. Bro, look at that. Easy, bro. You know what I'm saying? Easy. We can run all modifiers, too, but these Titans are, like, fake weak. I feel like I feel like with all modifiers. Oh my god, bro! Using that perk, I ain't gonna lie to you. Using that uh, that one perk that make you faster. Trust me, it, it does. Wow, nah. That perk make you dumb fast. What the hell? Like, bro, look at this. I'm I'm bugging. Nah, that's fast as hell, bro. What the hell? I'm surprised I'm even hitting my blades on time because I can't even grab my I can't even put the hook on his neck. Cause I'm too fast. But yeah, but we're doing like 62. I'm I'm assuming because they don't have enough health. And it's like I'm damn near hitting a critical damage every time. Cause it's it's popping up orange. It's not even like red anymore. For me, you see what I'm saying? And then when you use the strike, look at that. 30 seconds, bro. 30 seconds. Cool down. So, you know, you can get your Titan kills, you know, increase your blade every Titan kill. <clears throat> what I miss? All right, let me, let me stop. Let me stop doing this. Uh, 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 uh. I be forgetting, bro, how fun this is sometimes, just jumping around. I think this is probably the funnest mechanic right here is just to jump it, keep it a stack with you. I really like this. Like, nah, that, bro. I'm way too fast right now, bro. I gotta, like, get used to the speed. Yeah, nah, I gotta get used to the speed. Even switching is like, I'm rushing to click the buttons, bro. Like, I'm rushing to click the buttons. But, I, yeah, I'm gonna get used to this. Well, I'm obviously not gonna be using this, but when I do get it in my main slot, I'm gonna have to get used to that speed because I, I do wanna be that fast. But yo, brush out heads, take care, catch out in the next video, e cause out. And let me know in the comments down below, bro, which I think about that build. I feel like I dragged this video on a little bit, but I feel like it was worth it, you feel me? We got to see the damage, we got to look at the build, you know, just, just all around everything. And yes, the stream will be on. For those of y'all like, why should we care about a percentage? It's because I stream every day. So if you join the stream, you can get your percentage within the stream. It's really for the people that join the streams. And if you, you know, you could be one of those people. If you want to, you can always join and do raids with us. We do raids like damn near for like four or five hours on stream. Four or five hours. Um, when I'm working, I only do like around three hours when I have work. On these days like that, uh, like this when I'm off, I just, I do like four or five. But yeah, bro, I'm in the video here. Because I'll...